Oh, 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 oh. I know a song that gets on everybody's nerves. Everybody's nerves. Everybody's nerves. Wake me up inside. I am gonna play Bloodstained Ritual tonight. Oh yeah. By the way, thank you to gamers going blind for uh for you know the follow. Might as well, thank you. Oh yes. Playing more Bloodstained Ritual tonight. One of my favorite games. I did some grinding for some shards. Hopefully that's not too bad. I kinda maxed out on ma I'm maxed out on curse resist and poison resist. Getting curse resist is kinda painful. Because you know it requires you fighting requires you going through the train and waiting for that waiting for Kune Kune to show up and then you have to fight him. And then it's not really guaranteed that you get the shard. Oh well, at least it was a worth a lot of experience. Quite a bit. Oh yeah. Excuse me. Let's get right into the game, huh? I have a couple things I want to do. Go away, telemarketer. I don't need ya. Ugh. Good thing you guys can't hear that. Or at least you shouldn't. My settings are quite good. Mm. Let's get right into the game. Waiting for it to load. There we go. Just waiting for the loading. Here's something I want to do first. Um, that's a little strange. Here's the encrypted orchid I did. Right, encrypted orchid, yes. Oh, it only costs six to break down, okay. I don't want to break it down. Then I want to craft something. Wow, look at all those ammunition rounds I can make. Alright, let's look at our weapons. I want to make the Deathbringer. Let's see, here's the Deathbringer. Here we are. My 16 Bitcoin. Oh, yeah. We're getting in the crazy attack power now. Oh, yeah, look at that. That should be a lot more damaging than my uh, spiral sword. I really like using great swords in this game, it's just they're not really ideal for their speed. Of course, I have the speed, I have the weapon attack speed tome equipped. Still can't make the onion rice. Yeah, I have enough coins to be able to buy the last coin. 64,000. Ooh. Deep price. That's a lot of mo that's a lot of money for that. Do I have any copies of weapons to sell? Or any copies of armor? I got a couple of wolf hoods. Got some of these iron breastplates. Alright, now. A couple of those. Don't be too much. Now, 32 Bitcoin is a little expensive. I'm just glad we can make it at this point in the game. 
I kind of grinded. I kind of was doing some grinding and got a bunch of money together. Alright, I want to craft the last, last upgrade for it. Let's do it. And where is it? Right, I need the 8-bit nightmare to do it. Right. Oh, I guess I can't do it just yet. Well, that's fine. That's fine. An 8-bit nightmare, I believe, is a quest reward. Is a quest reward for doing the old woman. There you go. I don't have any seeds right now. Let's see, you're wanting a weapon. You're wanting one of these. I got 12 of them. Thankfully. That gave me the toy shoes. Alright, you're running a flame ring now. I know how to make that. I want to go to the ship, but I want to do some quests first. Might as well do that first. I might as well turn in my quest. Ooh, a cut first ring. I just wanted to get Lindsay's quest done. Oh right, we were supposed to make the flame ring, right. Almost forgot about that. How did I forget about that? Yeah, this Deathbringer Axe should be really powerful against the boss. Yeah, I want to craft a flame ring. I have a ruby to do it, so... Requires a rupee and one standard ring. Luckily, there is a way to get standard rings pretty easily from the monkeys. I got a couple of those earlier in the game. I thought you really grinded the monkeys too much. Alright, you want, you want the flame ring? Here you go. The chorus. I made a tea press. I don't need it anymore. I got a hair appearance. Are you wanting a hound vest? I think I can make the hound vest. I believe I have the material to make it. Alright, let's go make the hound vest real quick. What are the armors? Where is it? I'm best. There we go. This. Apparently, it doesn't require hound skin for some reason. I think the hound vest would require hound skin, but nope. Hound skins you get off the demon dogs. I don't know how to pronounce their name, sorry. Learn how to do it though. One best is what you're wanting. And I got a cowboy hat for free, but I don't need that. Flame circlet. I know how to make that. Make that, you need to buy a, cir a normal circlet from the shop. If I have enough money to do that. Hopefully, I do. If not, I might as well spend a couple of minutes grinding for money. Alright, where's the circlet? It should be here. And now that I got the circlet, I should be able to make the flame circlet. I like the Deathbringer axe. It also does some residual burning damage whenever it hits, sort of like the encrypted organ and its electric damage. Alright, where is the flame circlet here? Come back. Grab as much cash as I can. I get an average of 50 per handle. Heck, 
heck is that noise? I hear something. Oh, it sounds like it's losing its mind out there. Alright, what did you want again? Oh yeah, the plane circling. Here you go. Here's what you want. Ooh, Warlock's it... necklace. That's a good item. Wish I could get the silver tiara right now, but I can't do that. Can't do it right now. Oh yeah, that's a lot of damage. Making the Deathbringer actually is the right move. Hello. Uh, Much better than the axes in um, Dawn, of this, Dawn, of, Dawn of Sorrow. Definitely way better than that. Axes in that game are powerful, but they're the most powerful weapons, but they're so slow that you'll probably be doing way more DPS with, with faster, with faster, lower attack weapons. That's kind of the sad part about that. However, you can back dash cancel with the axe. Get up there. Oh well, that's not what I'm really here for. There you got a bunch of head foil shards. right there. More importantly is what's over here. Because we got Meow Classy up. And of course we got another gun. Not too bad. Of course there is one more thing we can do. I'm gonna try to do that real quick. to knock down some candles and hopefully get some cash. I need that money, I really do. Er, I mean, to get my gotcha pulls, or I mean, pay my taxes, yeah. I swear I'm not, I'm not wasting it on uh, getting a gotcha, getting a WWE gotcha, no. No, 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 no. No. I, I'm wasting it on, on, uh, on, um, um, I'm doing it with, I'm doing Genshin pulls, man. But yeah, that, that's what I'm using the money for, yeah. Right, yeah. Okay, this is not the right way. Right, I should have probably looked at the map first. Streaming and uh, 
Let's just say he inspires me to be a better streamer, man. That doesn't do that kind of thing. Alright, let's get up here and grab that. Over here is a plunderer's ring. A plunderer's ring is way better. Plunderer's ring is way better. That's a little less defense and con. It's fine, but look, that luck stat though. That luck stat though is pretty good. And I was able to bounce off your head and do that. Yeah, that's just a little trick. Getting a little tricky with it. Out of my way, I'm going to axe you a question with my big acting axe. Man, I wish I was better at video games than I probably. I enjoy playing Metroidvanias though. I also love RPGs a lot. RPGs are my jam. I've been collecting a few of them for quite some time. I'm gonna get back into Tales of Azaria. I'm telling myself that, and I never get around to it. Then again, I noticed one streamer who took quite a long time to do Octopath. And I eventually did it. Yeah. I need the final boss, too. Just half a million hit points, apparently. Oof. Half a mil. Yeah, but Gandora is pretty. Yeah, but Gandora is a pretty awesome, pretty awesome boss, though. Daughter of the Dark God awakens Cthulhu back, and then you start off on a journey to, you know, find advent to find adventure and get some money. You find adventure, get money, and then next, and then the following week you're out there punching Cthulhu in the face. Yeah, that's just how that's just how Octopath is, man. Awesome. Careful here. Keep my death bringer next. I'm gonna ask the bad guys a question. Now that I have an axe, I can make all the axe puns I want. Wait. You know, maybe I shouldn't make a bunch of axe puns. I'm sure if I make a bunch of axe puns, heads will roll. And I'll get exactly what I axed for. Bless you. <laughs> Oh yeah. Exactly. Exactly. Yo, let me beat up on some enemies with my big axe. Wait, that one's actually that one's actually real. That's an axe that does fire damage, so. Yeah, the description for it says it was made by an orc warlord, man. Uh, possible, um, World of Warcraft reference, maybe? Actually, I'm pretty sure the big Bitcoin weapons- I'm pretty sure the coin weapons were, uh, Kickstarter things. I believe. The Lecty Drifted Orchid and all them? Yeah. They're Kickstarter stuff. Yeah, there's quite a bit of Kickstarter stuff in this game. Oh yeah. That damage. That's way better than my Spiral Sword. Spiral Sword is pretty good, but it starts to fall off after a while. Spiral Sword is definitely very good, though. And I got it as a rare drop, too. Wish I got it on camera, though. I'll just ask you a question. Need more charts of that guy. Unfortunately, I'm waiting until I get luck boost. That guy... Yeah, Zangin shard is basically it lets you get more stuff from alchemy. Occasionally. And if you have, if you have it as a passive, it's pretty good. Plus you can stack it when... 
Oh yeah, give me that resist trait, yes. I want more of that. I definitely wanted more of that. I need to build up my resist strike, but unfortunately this is not a good grind spot for that. There is one coming up that's much better. Of course we're going to have to ride the train a little bit. I could show you how to do Kune Kune again. Mm, on second thought I better not. He's actually pretty dangerous. Of course I got a big fiery axe of death. I got a big fiery axe of death, so it shouldn't be no problem. Look at that damage. Yeah. I wish I had to eat that nightmare to upgrade it all the way, but that's... You only get one as a quest reward, and uh... The only other way to get it is to beat the 8-bit nightmare over and over and over again. And hope that he drops it. As an item. Yeah, super bosses drop items in this game. They're very necessary for actually finishing your stuff up. And that damage is way more consistent, way better. Like that. Oh yeah. We're gonna ask some bad guys a few more questions before we move on. First let me just ask some candles. Let me ask some candles a very important question. What does Potagree do? Yes, tell me, what does Potagree do? Nobody knows what Potagree does because it's a complete mystery to everyone. Yeah, Potagree, a complete mystery. Axe. There we go, get it down. Pretty sure one of these walls is breakable. Yeah, eat that axe. There we go, HP up max. Ooh, that assassin got in my way. Let's knock him down real quick. So happy not to. So happy I got a ring and also got these bunny ears. I mean, the bunny ears are cute. Not as cute as Bunny Morphosis, though. I mean, Bunny Morphosis is Bunny Morphosis, though. Bunny Morphosis is super sexy. Or, I mean, um, not that I'm into that or anything, no. A a absolutely not. I, I don't know what you're talking about, no. No, 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 no. I don't know. I certainly ne never would do such a thing, no. Ooh, this guy has a really good shard. The enemies are actually taking a couple hits to take down. There's another puppy, that's a Kickstarter pet. And we got another resist, right? Awesome. I wasn't expecting that, to be honest. I take him down, beat him up. Harry Potter and Black Pepper, I need a Black Pepper. I need a Black Pepper, though. Dominique? What are you doing here? Oh, Miriam. Dominique. What are you doing? Looking for Zangetsu. Have you seen him? Yes. We fought together aboard the train. What? Zangetsu was with you. Dominique, why are you upset What's that Zangetsu was with me? Are you jelly of my love? For are you jelly of our love? Yes, what's wrong, Dominique? Tell me. I'm sure it's nothing. Dominique is a good girl. But she is a good girl in Curse of the Moon, too. Would you ask him to report back to me? Alright. Sadly, this is not Curse of the Moon, too. In fact, Curse of the Moon and Curse of the Moon, too, have nothing to do with this game because they're not canon with each other. And Mr. Ika says all the Cur all the Blood Saint games have nothing to do with each other. I mean, I'm sure one day that'll change. Maybe. Here we go. We got Damascus and Black Pepper. Watch out for the poison toads. I don't like their poison. Wish I could get up there. Pretty sure the boss is just up ahead. 
I'm going to use a save point. Alright, what's my strategy? I could just face tank and roll. Don't get out of here, you poor detail that I don't like yet. I don't like being detoxified. I don't like pox- I don't like poison. Alright, now let's go. Damn, this guy's like Sonic the Hedgehog, he's so cool. Sonic the Hedgehog. Oh, killing Sonic the Hedgehog was a big plus in this uni is a big plus in this universe. I hate that hedgehog. I'm just kidding, I'm just referencing Dr. Robotnik. I don't actually hate Sonic. I'm only kidding, I was only joking. I I'm only referencing I'm only referencing Dr. Eggman. Oh no, I'm poisoned! Why am I poisoned? Why am I toxic? Snort. Yes, I'm very toxified, guys. That was toxic. Why I don't like poison toads? They toxify you. Yeah, you're stop being toxic. Or, I mean, um. I, I just don't want to be toxified, yeah? Sure, I can reach up there. Here we go. I don't think the cat has a poison cloud shard. Mask us equipment, I wanted that. Give me your shard. I can just beat you up. Either way is fine. Mark speed for me. I like how much damage this axe is doing. Spiral Sword's nice, but not at this point in the game. Plus this axe kinda hits twice in one turn. Yeah, this is also a Kickstarter pet, by the way. Oh, there we go, we got the shard. Toxic Storm, whip up a poisonous whirlwind. Oh yeah. Out of my way. Out of my way, you poisonous toads. No, good thing I resisted the poison there. Out of here. No toxic. And we can use Reflector Ray, of course. First reflector ray also extends off of mirrors. Just lets you zoom really quickly to one place to the next. Alright, level up! Oh, and we got the shard! Yeah! Give me more of them. They should my less for power. Oh, whoops, I fell down. Gold necklace? Cool. And of course a mana up, that's always important. Especially in this game, where you really want to use magic. Magic's kind of really good in this game. 
Alright, another one of those both glass. I want more of those. Ooh, there's a strike, yes. Give me that. Alright, you got that. Give me that blue shark, yes. Healing. It's much less impressive than it sounds, really. Oh, I got another one. And this one's a mimic. I'm just gonna kill that thing real quick. Over here we can use Reflector Ray to get in here. Over to Power Ring. And what's over here? First it's a war point. Let's see, we need to go to the cathedral next. Let's see, I got a I got equipment upgrades to go through too. Might as well upgrade my equipment before I go. Plus I got all those resist strike and healing shards. And I wanna save those just in case I die to bloodless. Not that bloodless is necessarily that difficult. I mean, she's certainly not easy. Not an easy boss by any means, man. For a sight finder, not that difficult, to be honest. Are you what are we transmuting this time? Probably just me, though. We can make the consummate finally. I'll go with this. And since I can make the consummate, I can make the omni rice. Right. With this. And I need Omni Rice for the old woman anyway. Great. Okay, what else am I missing? Place yourself. Up. All right, then I say you want to save. I'll do the old woman in a minute. I'll go visit Susie in a minute. I know Susie is very important. But you know, so it's that so it's saving the game. Let's go visit her. Dominique should be fine then. Alright, I got the Omni race. And I got a spear for that, for all that trouble. And she's wanting some sort of, and she's wanting a crepe. In this chamber where the bell hmm wait the room was an ocean and if i'm reading well yeah bloodless is really be... tough what do you I wish bloodless would do something if you got wounded but no all right the food items are right you need to buy a strawberry cream is this plenty thanks Where's the Omni Rice? Where is it? Where is it? Here we are. Is this really? Thank you. I'll buy a couple pizza. Is this when we have a deal? Thank you. Did there we go. Another robe, yes. You're running some spaghetti now. I believe I have the spaghetti somewhere. What are you looking to buy? I believe I have the spaghetti recipe. Is this when we have a deal? Where is the spaghetti? Okay, it wasn't that. Don't Must have been something else. Well, I'll figure it out later. 
Now I should probably upgrade my equipment. Are you what are we transmuting this time? Anything here? I can make a keep these beret. A little bit of extra defense and more attack. But I don't really like the luck hit luck hit luck. Alright, I guess I'll make one. I'll go with this. I need durable letter for that. I like doing silver bugs, play this little crazy strong. I would like more attack though. Excuse me. Silver breastplate with less time. Stop back. Alright now. One more thing that I want to do before I go beat Gladwell's stuff. Gladwell's is very tough now. I just want to say. Of course, Gladwell's is also a white, is also a, a top tier white boo. That is if you don't mind a woman that's inspired by Elizabeth Bathory. Much like another famous sexy villain is, you know, Lady D. Oh, Lady Dum- Lady Dum- Dummy Trask. Yeah, I remember her quite well. Best waifu. Er, I mean, um, she- she was the first boss of the campaign in, um, Resident Evil 8, yeah. And she was quite, um, beautiful, yes. Er, I mean, um, scary, yeah. She was very, very scary, yeah. Yes, I certainly don't have any thirst for her now. She's certainly a very attractive woman, but, uh, or, I mean, uh, listen, I, I just think she's, I just think she's beautiful, yeah? A lot of people think the same way. Not weird or anything, no. I need to stop making it weird, making it sound worse, isn't it? Let me get me if you dare. My axe. Screamer who uh pretends to be a fairy on the internet. There we go, we got the pasta dishes. We did it. Yeah, I did it. Okay, I picked off the candles and got it with style. Yeah, there's no bonus for style, but look. I got it earlier than I was supposed to. Normally, you need Invert to be able to get that. Or you can just kick off the candles. I decided to kick off the candles because it was more fun that way. And I'm sure you'll agree.
think Final Sorrow axes or not. Again, Dawn of Sorrow axes were kind of slow. But I fell through. Out of my way, werewolf. I think that they have the classic werewolf. That's pretty good. Normally in Castlevania, werewolf is a boss. Or a low tier enemy. Depending on which game it is. Portrait Rune, I like him as a boss. That is pretty good. Pretty good in Portrait Rune as a boss. Have a classic Castlevania monster as a boss. Classic Universal monster as a boss. Pretty cool. I like classic, un I like classic monsters. I wish the Dark Universe took off, but sadly it kind of fell apart after the, after you know that bad that Monday movie. If I wanted to watch the Mummy, I'd watch the Mummy. I watched the other mum, the other the Mummy. Thank you very much. Oh, I could go. No, I could go back and see what these new dishes are all about. I'll just check them out real quick. Not real quick. One of the rest, maybe if it'll get, maybe if we get classic spaghetti, it'll make the thing that the that Susie wants. It's good. All right, so, what can I do there? Where's the recipe? Oh, we need consomme, huh? White sauce. Heavy cream and dragon egg. Okay, right, let's check out what all these dishes actually do, though. XP game up? Well, I'd like to make that, but I don't know how to make the sauce for it. We'll stick with classic spaghetti for now. I'll go with this. Great. Classic spaghetti. I'll go with this. Great. Stop back. I don't have the drink recipe yet, so I won't be able to do anything about that. Drink recipe is in the library. It's quite a tough dungeon. Are you, we could make what something we else with this time? Heavy cream, dragon egg. Oh, we need white sauce. Alright, I might as well go back and buy some white sauce so I can buy some more food. Mix food. What are you looking to buy? Right, here's the boss. Is this thank you? Is this plenty thanks? There you go, give me all that white sauce. Transmuting this. There we go. Classic and pasta. I'll go with. 
take this. Here, Chen has it. Great. Crazy shenanigans without convert. Be able to actually get it. Another bottom top card, but I already got nine of those. I already got a bunch of those. Alright, time to go to the cathedral. And we need to get out reflector ready for that. Starter pet. Goodbye, Kickstarter pet. One shot that thing. Look how damage is my spiral sword. We got another shaggy expertise. Better yet, any of those. Here. Yeah. Ammo capacity up. Might as well grab that, that's very important. I ain't got a club. Yeah. Alright, let me show you a little something about skill that you can use to break the game. Obviously, it's about to act, 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 snort. Yeah. I'm just kidding, of course. Just joking. I don't actually think that. I guess that would be funny to say. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Not that bad. Over here is a silver knight familiar. Guess we'll grab that. HP max up. Awesome that we got that. Pretty awesome sauce. Sauce is pretty awesome. I like sauce. My favorite sauce is Alfredo sauce. Of course we don't have to always have it. Ooh, the Occupet. Ooh, you got apples too. So I'm pretty sure you have a quest to slay some of those. I have a quest to slay some of them, plus I went through shard anyway. I will get nine of the shards later. Plus I want their apples anyway so I could actually make some more food. Get more shards. Like having 50, 50 points of luck. Oh well, I'll just grind for it late. I'll just grind for it. What it does is it increases your attack speed. Like Tether, I kinda need I kinda need those. I need Flight Cutter to upgrade a shard anyway. Might as well keep trying to get it. Not gonna grind for nine of them, obviously, on stream. Monster Bird's here. Uh, that's probably like it's common drop. When I want some more apples. 
I have pickpocket on him. Mine isn't doing anything. Keep on steak. Might as well grab the steak at least. Oh, there we go. Yeah, optimizer shard. Increase weapon attack speed. Yes. That is indeed what it does. Uh oh. Oh, I don't like this. There's Medusa heads everywhere. I don't like it. Get me out of this crazy place. I don't like it. Medusa heads. Medusa heads, I don't like them. Nobody likes you. Scrambled eggs. Might as well grab that. Gotcha. You can test it for teas. So if you like to use boots, that's a good that's a good thing for you. That is if you actually like to use boots, for whatever reason. Like Elemental has Light Resist. Yeah, Light Resist doesn't, doesn't really come up too much in this game. How many enemies in this game actually do light damage? Oh no, Will's Pranchy Lady, no. Out of here. Can't go through there. Have no choice but to go. I don't like these guys. Yeah, then you have to resist Petrified Shard, too. You have to resist Petrified. equipment. I can use 
I just dropped the stuff that came down. That part is an important There we go, resist petrify. I could get resist petrify right now. Probably get nine of these after I beat up Bloodless. Alright, there we go, another one. Petrification resistance doesn't equal petrification immunity in this game. That is very, very bad. Very unfortunate, I know. Super important to get it. Isn't super important to get it. This way leads to save points. Yes, I need one of those. I wish petrification resistance equaled immunity, but no. Not in this game. This game is just straight resistance. Here is Miss Bloodless's place. We're gonna have to fight her. Alright, I forgot I have a reflector ray on. special surprise. Oh, look at that sticky white stuff. Oh boy, that is weird. I can't believe I made it into a meme, guys. Yeah, she's covered in nuts. She's covered in nut juice. Got 
weird that that she's all white. <laughs> Very weird making her all white. That was a mistake. I made Bloodless all white. Just for the meme. Oh boy. Yeah. Yeah, I did it on purpose, guys. Just for the lols. For the lols, the only reason to troll. <laughs> oh boy. Well, she wasn't exceptionally difficult. I mean, Deathbringer did most of the work. Easy peasy. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Very easy. Alright, let's go find a warp point, huh? Fortunately, this way leads to the library, and I don't like the library one bit. It's full of spikes and traps and other fun things that will ruin your day. Umbrella. I mean, we're finding good stuff right now. actually have something I really want. Alright, aside from the smoothie. In fact, I'm gonna drink that smoothie right now. Because it has MP recharge on it. Mogo Death does have a good charge. Well, actually, her charge is actually pretty useless, but she has a thing I need for a different charge. different chart. Alright, I don't have this reflector ray. Musician who kind of wants to kick your butt. He's pretty nice. I like her. Chair Mimic. Chair Mimic has a very interesting chart I should say. Not that it's particularly good or anything, but it does have a use that you may not think of. 
But it really does have you. Oh no. We'll play the dragon. We got the dragon egg and got the drink recipe. Awesome, now we got the drink recipe. Oh, I need a bookcase, don't I? these bookcases one bit. I'm gonna need craft work for this. Medusa heads now. I'm very triggered by anything Medusa head like in any video game really. Medusa heads trigger me on a deep and personal level, guys. I I just can't see them. I just can't see even with them, man. I of course I'm very I of course I'm kidding, of course. They aren't that bad, really. Again, my memories of my one of my earliest memories of Castlevania is being killed by a Medusa head. I wouldn't say they're not terrible. Honestly, are Medusa heads really as bad as people say they are? Granted, I in classic style Castlevania, I think they're a little bit worse. And what I'm familiar with. Oh, I got the shard! I got the chair shard! Yeah, give me that shard. Summon a chair? Yep, it really does let you summon a chair. Oh, I got that shard too. Yeah, this is good luck. That's good luck, guys. Drop wings here, so I get upgrade up. So you get pick pocket up to max level. Oh well, not that I need it. I need it. Probably not. Okay. Oh no. I don't like this room. Not my way chair, maybe. Get me out of here. It's not that bad, really. Over here is the yeah. health points. At least I at least go back to those. I'll come back to that like to that horrible level later. Not as bad as the underwater section, trust me. The underwater section with those traps is definitely hell. 
I don't know why. I don't know what Ego was thinking when he came up with that, man. Yeah, the underwater spikes where you have to use Deep Seema to move about underwater, but it's kind of tricky to do that. Because you might run into some traps that do percent face damage. Alright, might as well save. Alright, I should probably check out what the drinks and equipment actually do. Are you eat so what'll it be? Brown cake. Strawberry cake. Oh, that's a good luck fix. Of course, here's the most important ones of them all. I'll go with this. I'll go with this. I'll go with this. The reason why those are important. Great. I'll go with this. This will make all the cakes in there, yeah? Great. Great. Yeah. Good. Okay, if I had some cookies, I'd be able to get that. If I had a couple of apples, I'd be that. Stop back. Alright, let's buy some cookies. Bad yeah. apples you cannot buy. You just have to get them from the you do have to get them from the Occupet. Oh well, I am planning on grinding the Occupet anyway. Yeah. Planning on grinding that one anyway. I have Might as well what do are it you looking to buy? Is this then we have a deal? Let's hope we go for that, okay? Is this plenty thanks? Is this then we have a deal? Thank you. Is this many thanks? Oh, Is this now. thank you? These cookies. These cookies. Have them somewhere. Here we are. Is this then we have a deal? I got my soul turned into less. Did you want to? Lemonade. Give us a list card because we don't have to actually make that. Yes, I'll help. Something breaded. I suppose I'll. Don't think I know how to make that just yet. Yeah. I believe the silver tiara also drops off the hook. Oh, hey there. It's good to see you. Oh, sorry, you're late. Oh. Okay. Okay, you're not uh, you're not under any obligation to be here. I'm happy you start by. Thank you for showing up. It may be late, but you're deaf. You missed the fight with Bloodless where I made where I made the blood color white. Great. Yeah, it has a really strange effect on her when I do that. Which makes it sort of hilarious. Alright now. I guess I could do a couple things then. Alright, now. First off, I should probably drink all my drink, drink, eat and drink all the stuff I made. The luck boost, I want those. I want the extra points of luck, really. MP recharge is very good on these. Oh yeah. Damn, reminds me of Seven Deadly Sins for Season 3. Oh yeah. Oh, they made- they did that and see- they did that! Oh... Was it a succubus? Not a lot would be white in one frame and then red in the next. <laughs> yeah. 
Making a blood white, making a blood white with bloodless does have the interesting effect of making it look like nut juice. Yeah, that's what we're calling it. Nut. I like the word nut. Nut is a hilarious word. Nut. I'm a nut. You're a nut. We're all nuts here. And it's true. We're all nuts here. I'm mad. You're mad. We're all mad here. Some of us more mad than others. Oh yeah. Let's go through the library. Let's go through library hell. Wait, that's not what I wanted to do. Here we go. Nope, I don't like spikes. Get me out of there. I don't like anything with lots of spikes and traps in this game, no. That's why the underwater section in this game is so good. Alright, let's go over here. I remember there being a thunder elemental here. Yeah, we one shot those guys. Easy peasy. Risu would approve. Oh. Oh, Risu, the girl that... Risu is a streamer that speaks to me on a deep and personal level because she hates normies, just like I do. <laughs> yeah, that's mainly... That's the one thing I remember about her. Of course it would be, wouldn't it? Can we also... I don't like these malfictions. Got you. Got you, Medusa heads. I don't like you. Then again, does anybody like Medusa heads, really? Yeah, I'm not falling for that. That's a mimic. I believe the mimic has a shard that makes you get. that if you get more money, it makes you stronger. Oh, what? I just got it. Money is power. This is a good spot that there's any to grind it in. Now, don't knock me out the air. Come here, Medusa heads. You're blight on society. Heads, nobody likes you. Now, got knocked into the spikes. Ow. No, oh, I don't like spikes. I don't like spikes because they do so much damage to you. Thunder resist, cool. Hey there, what's up? I wanna talk to you. Hi! Hey, what's up? You're just in time for me to go into the Hall of Germination and uh, beat up... and go beat up the Abyss Gar Abyssal Guardian. I'll just go do that real quick. Remember, one of these rooms is not actually a boss room. I was gonna use it for one. Here we are, this is the boss room. The other one you need a key for, and it leads to a music box room. Now we're up against a huge dragon. Oh boy. Don't worry, this guy's not too hard. On the first try? Awesome. Nothing much but chilling watching, how are you? Oh, I'm doing fine, right? Boy, Ray, I can't believe I got that in the first try, guys. You're not guaranteed to get that shard either. But getting it this early is definitely really good. 
Apparently you can only get it when you get to the den, den of Behemoths. You see? I'm going to save after that boss fight. And we are going to head into the Hall of Termination. The Hall of Termination, not to be confused with the Hall of Determination, or the Hall of Judgment. Now, in that we would have to fight a Skeletro. That is really, really tough. Yeah. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more hyperlink blocks. Might as well meme it up in the comments, huh? Don't forget to don't forget to post a meme in the comments below. What's your favorite meme? Uh, tell me if you really want to. All right, let's go ask some bad guys a question. Well, I don't want them to be on top of me when I ask them that. Very unwise. Alright, give me that reverse mind. Give me that resist mind charge. No. Not gonna give it to me, huh? Alright then. Two ultimate healing items, that's good. I'll take the face. Punch cake and wool. So I can pull the wool over people's eyes. Not for any nefarious reason. I thought you were dead. Alright, now. A blood burner sword right there. Let's knock you out of the air. Knock him out. Good casting with the axe. If I had nine optimizer, it would be. Gotcha. That's a new enemy. The Archdemon. He has a pretty good shard. This shard, if you basically max it out, it gives you, uh, like, uh... Gives you the chance to get zero, zero cost on, on your, uh, on your specials. On your magic attacks. So whenever you use shards, it's pretty good. Alright, I forgot I had that on. Alright, take a look at Bunny Morphosis. Yes. Look at this. Yeah. No, harder than the other two you mentioned? No, this hole is not that bad. Not as bad as the library before it, though. I used to dislike the library because there's a bunch of traps and there's Medusa heads. Anything that just had like triggers any Castlevania player, really. Nobody used to play Castlevania likes Medusa heads, even though they're a staple of the game. That's sort of the joke with them. Da -de -da -de -da. The bun um, bunny girl outfit, yeah. He also kicks bad guys in the face while using it. Plus, thanks to all the drinks I drank, you actually can, you can actually stay on the field without using the MP. I if I can get up there. Ah, uh, not quite. I don't have enough range. Yeah, Bunny Morphosis is pretty cool. Less damage in my axe, though. Yeah, I made a, I made a 16 bit coin weapon. Oh, watch out for the blood bringer sword right there. It gives you a sword familiar, and then, then that sword familiar is pretty nice. Not my favorite familiar, though. My favorite familiar is the one I'm using right now. Hitting the hammer heads are pretty good. In fact, let me show you dual hammer heads. You get your own Medusa heads, and they float around you, and they will attack enemies by rushing into them. Which makes them especially nice. Fine equipment, awesome. Now let me make better equipment right now. Uh, 
Consumption. That one's pretty nice if you get it up to nine. Also, if you get it really up to nine, you have a chance of basically having zero cost in your magic attacks. It's not quite as good as evil glasses, but it's really but it's something. Yeah, it's pretty good. Gauge glasses. I believe the gauge glasses let you see what the enemy's HP is. Alright, I got an axe shard. Awesome, give me that. Throwing axe, throw a spinning axe, yay. That is a good shard. Alright, now. Does axe that tiny other question? Yeah, I like, told oh, you may be the ruler of the fairy realm, which is. which is where. which is where I'm from, but. And this Titania has a little bit more best buying than I remember. Yeah. There we go. Zero cost is pretty nice. Yes, it is. It most certainly is. Well, that room up there leaves you millionaire's pain. We don't have the key for that yet. That's not until a little bit later in the game. Alright, at least we're in range of getting the bad... At least in range of getting the bad ending. The good ending is not too bad. The good ending, well... Well, you missed the fight with Bloodless, but she has a very important ability that's very essential to getting the true ending. Up here. And there's a secret area up here. And we'll go through that just yet. Ooh, what's this? Hair apparent, cool. Or hairstyles for me. Play around with if I want. I'll be fine, yes. Give me more of that. Graham Celeski. 1000 gold. MP max, HP max. Over here is a super dungeon. And also a picture of a very familiar person. That's Mr. Ega! Dang, put himself right next to the super dungeon. Fortunately, we're not quite high level enough for that. We're not quite equipped for that just yet. But you can try it now if you really want to. Don't worry, it's pretty tough since this 8 bit nightmare is no joke. 8 bit nightmare, no joke. And it's basically an entire stage full of really tough enemies, and then at the end, you have a fight with a super boss that's harder than the actual final boss of this game. I know because King Bale is very, very easy to beat in this game. At least if you're playing as Miriam. Yeah, 8-Bit Nightmare, though, will give you some trouble. He's really that tough. Oh, 
Alright, let's go. I just want to upgrade my equipment before getting the bad ending. Which I know I want to try getting first. Right now, craft. So, what'll it be? All the armor. I wish I could make all these things. I don't have the things I require for all this. materials to make all these things. Uh, and with four more demon things I'd be able to No, oh, it's not super important Stop to get it. At least not right now. I'll just have to get them later. Nice axe right there. Beat him up with that axe. Don't have the materials to upgrade, so I'm going to go get the bad ending. Oh, termination! Thank you. Oh yeah. Now you're probably wondering how you get the good ending. Now you need blood steel. I think we already fought Bloodless and got that. Alright, let's go get that bad ending. I think we can break the stairs here. I'm not gonna do that right now. Go through the door and fight Jable. There's different endings in the game? Oh yeah, there's like three different endings. There's a first bad ending, there's a second bad ending, and then there's a true ending. The first bad ending is what we're going for. What took you so long? Well, now that you've tasted the power of so many shards, I presume you're ready to join me. You presume wrongly. I'm here to keep my promise to you, and nothing else. What promise? You really have... I swore to you that I would stop you if your Shardbinder power ever manifested itself against your will. You made the same oath to me. Please! You think I wield this power unwillingly? I do. I've known it since our meeting on the Galleon. There was a moment when I saw a flicker of the real Jeebel beneath all that hate. Fool! I've heard enough! If you want to stop me, You'll have to do it by force. Alright, time to do battle. Okay. Time to battle Jeebel. Use a lot of mountain points. Use a lot of spells. That's what I'll do when I'm also use this. Watch out for lightning. Now, hopefully you didn't do that much damage with that. Got him. And see that red moon there? You're supposed to slice that later. Forgive me, Jeebo. <laughs> you... You... That's gonna lead to a bad ending. Is what? Is it over now? We did what we came here to do. We stopped. But the castle is still there. The demon. Yes, but Dominique and the church can take it from here. You think so? Yeah, I don't trust Dominique. Dominique's I us. A bad feeling about all of this. What would you have us do? It... Perhaps. Yeah, if you do that, you just get game over. Yep, we got the bad ending. There you go.
Well, the solution is not to kill our pet, not to kill our friend. Whoops. <laughs> oh no. Well, that was a bad ending. I hear every door you open and I know just where you're going. Well, they we... Well, that's a bad end of the game. I think that'll be enough for right now. Let's go see who's on so I can raid him, huh? I believe Echoes might be still streaming. Yeah, she's still on. Raid Echo Saren. Alright, now let's do this. Remember to play games in that fun, okay? Don't forget today's raid message, Moon Bat Raid! There we go. 